Hey everyone, Natalie back here with another channel message for you guys. I hope everyone is doing well right now. Um, please use your discernment when it comes to these readings, all right? Uh, please do not put yourself in situations that don't belong to you, all right? Also keep in mind, energies can be reversed. Time is fluid, all right? If anyone needed a personal reading, you're more than welcome to message me. My email is in the description box below for you down there, along with everything else you need to know about this reading. If you like a beautiful bouquet of uh, roses out here, like the one that you see here, um, my promotion code is down there too. So you guys can use the promotion code to get a discount. All right. Um, what else? Oh, yeah. Um, I do not charge people to just talk to me through email. Okay. If anyone needs someone to talk to, you're more than welcome to talk to me. All right. So let's get a message for you guys right now. What needs to be known? What needs to be said for my collective? Holy Spirit and angels, when it comes to this reading, give me a well-deserved high vibrational message that everyone needs to see right now. Holy Spirit and angels. What is going on? Oh, okay. Dang, the Anunnaki keeps coming. I'm not the Anunnaki. Uh... I said the Anunnaki, but the Octorian light codes, evolutionary downloads, recalling power, and future thinking, all right? All right, something about this card is telling me something about, like, you're just getting downloads right now. Your downloads are coming through heavily, especially during the new moon in Gemini. Yeah, star gathering, stars align, remembering home and soul family. Remember where you're coming from? Remember, um, I feel like you guys are a star. Mm -hmm. I'm tapping into some stars right now. Um, the Octurian light codes. All right, you guys are seeing lights. You guys are getting some sort of headaches, piercing right now. Some of you are some of you are trying to take your energy. Is what I'm getting here. Someone feels like they could take your energy. All right, let me get one card, please, for the collective when it comes to this reading. I'm not going to read about that card because I feel like I've read about it enough. Uh, let your fears dissolve. Full moon and cancer. All right. Hmm. Push through any insecurity. A lot of your guys' karma stems from fear. Right? Like you're, you're afraid to do something or you're afraid to not do something. Okay? Spirit is saying let your fears dissolve and go wild. Attune to the divine and take a breather. Take a, a reality check too, okay? Yeah, I just heard not everything is about you. Someone here need to hear that. These Octorians out here are set to remind you of something about your karma so that you don't repeat your karma, all right? So just pay attention. If you're not sure where your karma stems from, check your Saturn placement. Yeah, acceptance is out here. I'm learning to accept the things that I cannot change. Mm -hmm. Discipline, I can accomplish what I set my mind to. I really feel like someone here is not accepting the things that they cannot change. I feel like there's an energy out here that is accepting things. Someone here is not accepting things. So I guess the lesson for this karma, karmic, you know, cycle right now could be accepting things. Let me get one more, please, for the collective right now. Four oh four on the clock. Getting like a gathering, like like you have ancestors around you get oh i see what this is talking about it's time for healing not war mm. a lot of your ancestors did nothing but fight wars take control of your own narrative all right oh i see where this is going all right watching people try to get underneath your skin it's time for healing, not war. Take control of your own narrative. It will mess with the narrative of your life if you try to cause war all the time. 444 on the clock as I said that. Hmm. Someone may try to attack you, but it's time for healing, not war. Hmm. I, and you know what? That's something I have to learn too. When I'm backed up in a corner, isolation, see? 
when I'm backed up in the corner or isolated, or if I feel like a lot of people are attacking me, I'm just going to start dogging everybody. <laughs> like, I just dog everybody. Like, forget you, forget you, forget you, forget you. And, yeah, I feel like something about, like, you got to not do that, all right? Accept that thing. Accept, just accept the things that are being said about you. Accept something out here. Because someone, someone here is going to try it. But it's time for healing and not war. Let your fears dissolve. It's okay to be in this energy of, of accepting things. You're not going to die because people are attacking you. All right? Um, you're not going to be... Oh, thank you, spirit. You're not going to be seen as weak. That's also something I had to learn, too. You're not going to be seen as weak because, you know, you don't want to fight in a situation. You probably have a lot to lose. You probably um, have people watching you. Or you probably have something here coming in your energy and it's very great and people want to stop it. All right. So just keep that in mind. All right. There's barely a lot of there's I mean, when you look at look at like the I don't know, we'll use this as an example. We'll use Beyonce as an example. All right. Not a lot of people like Beyonce, but she doesn't even care because she's she has a lot of things going on in her life. She's not running the streets, fighting everybody that talks about her, all right? It's like that type of energy. A limited abundance keeps coming out. So it looks like you guys are on the brink of a limited abundance. And you guys don't want to ruin that, do you? All right. What's going on with the collective right now in this reading? All right. Dreams, illusions, and delusions came out like the last reading. Awareness, transportation in a car. I'm going to put this back. I'm going to put this back. And you want to know something? I'm going to grab the other half of my index cards. And we're going to do that instead. Smear campaign at the bottom. Immature and blaming. All right. What is going on with the energy right now? The collective in this reading. Holy Spirit and angels fighting back. Yeah. Okay. So we have fighting back out here. Some, some people may want you to fight back. But Spirit said it's time for healing, not war. Don't lose your focus. What's going on with the collective right now? Mm -mm 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 -mm. This reading, what's going on? Somebody wants you to act low vibrational. A change in the family okay it could be like a big change in the family out here all right what else please for the collective right now holy spirit and angels travel for work oh oh i just heard something else too hold on all right so we have good idea out here i'm a dark witch or i know one then we have the moon cancer mother sensitivity and emotions does someone here travel for like spell work to go see <gasps> Oh my gosh, okay. Six chakra, third eye energy, silencing you. Someone here traveled to get work done to silence you. Um, you know exactly who this person is, but if you expose them, you're gonna look crazy, guys. You're gonna look crazy. You'll know who this person is because there's there's gonna be a death around them or a death in the family because of them. Fake pregnancy and sickness, someone here try to make you sick by silencing you. Or they try to fake their pregnancy. They try to play victim. They try to fake sick. Wow. Since the, I sense that there's black magic in this reading. I'm going to use my pure magic deck. Um, my pure magic deck. My pure magic oracle deck from Andreas and Gracia. Um, I got this off of Amazon. Okay. These cards reflect white magic. So since I sense that there's black magic here being done. We're going to read about some white magic before I get into the tarot. Okay. So bear with me here. I'm starting to use these more um, whenever I sense, you know, dark magic here being done. But yeah, someone here definitely used the dark witch against you. And it could be someone in your guys' family. How depressing is that? Especially with the mother energy out here. It could be someone's mom or a cancer who traveled for work. Like she... Could have asked someone to do spell work on you or she actually went out into a different country and traveled to get the work done okay what's going on 
What can the collective do to combat this energy? What can the collective do to combat this black magic, this dark energy out here? What can the collective do to combat this dark energy out here? Holy Spirit and angels. It says closing circle, pure intent, sacred doors, timing, and experience. See how she's quiet? I'm going to read about this. She has her uh, finger over her mouth. Ancestors, family, survival, death, and worship. Something about someone's family is really important. It keeps coming out in my readings today. All right. Let's see. 35. We're going to read about this protection spell. That So pay attention if you're being attacked in your family or if you feel like someone's family is attacking you. All right. Pay attention. Uh, the ritual of closing circles is the last act of any spell, ritual, prayer, or ceremony. It releases and disperses all energies used in magical practice and allows us to close our work down for the universe to join in and connect. As human beings, our lives are run through the framework of time and stages of beginnings and endings. We are all giving, given a running clock from birth and told to use it with wisdom. Under this rule, we must acknowledge that some things have an expiration date to work with or into it. The act of closing the circle enables us to understand we are part of the great cycle and have power to disconnect to the things, to the right things at the right time. Not everyone will be in your life from start to finish. We all walk our own path and some people stay for seasons or reasons. Consider your values and make the appropriate choice with pure intent. Okay, yeah. Again, this, this is white magic out here. Let's see what it says to do. Finish any ritual or spell work with a closing circle practice to dissipate the energy and raised and make the energy raised and make sure the elements are properly recognized and given thanks. The circle of light you built up in the opening circle practice. I highly advise you to uh, guys get this book. Okay. Opening circle can now be safely disconstructed. Say, I give thanks to spirit for blessing this ritual. May it be for the highest good of all. Face north and turning in a counterclockwise direction, say, so it looks like spirit wants you to say this while moving around in a circle. This is face north and turning in a counterclockwise direction, say, I give thanks to the element of earth of north and the forest for bringing your quiet strength. I give thanks to the element of water of west and the ocean for bringing your insight. I give thanks to the element of fire of south and the sun for bringing your protection. I give thanks to the element of air of east and the wind for bringing the clarity. Farewell. Tend to any candles that have been lit during the course of your spell work and discard any unneeded items. This is a good time to eat and drink something to ground your energy and bring you back to the earthly realm. The universe can now start to work its magic. All right. So it has a lot to do with east, west, north, south energy. Give thanks to the water, the air, the earth, and the fire. And go back and repeat what I said, all right? So that was a spell to protect your energy, to close out any energies, all right? Let's get into the tarot, because that was a lot. But I just feel like someone here traveled for work for you guys. Three of Pentacles and the Emperors out here. Someone here wants to work together with you guys, or you guys are being um, included in a work group. Wheel of Fortune out here is in the reverse. Something here is going to go backwards on somebody else. All right. Let's see. What's the energy, please, for the collective Holy Spirit and angels? Magician in the reverse. Justice out here. What else, please, for the collective Holy Spirit and angels? Three of Wands in the reverse. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, King of Pentacles is in the verse with the Six of Wands out here. And the Chariot. To be honest with you guys, I don't really think you need the spell work, but I, don't, I really don't think you need the white magic to defeat this person. I feel like this person's already defeated. Yeah, okay, we have the Hierophant out here in the verse with, with Temperance in the verse. Sagittarius, Taurus energy, also seeing Gemini, Virgo, and Aries. King of Pentacles is in the verse. Someone here is like losing everything. It's like they're... Someone is like being financially drained out here. Someone's reputation is being messed up too. 
or they feel this way. Close, please, for the collective. Someone here has, like, the mind of, like, someone who's, like, very unorthodox. Um, they don't really say, they don't really believe in what they say that they believe in, or else they wouldn't be doing all this dark magic out here. This cancer energy. Then we have the uh, eight, of pe eight of Cups in the reverse out here. Someone here wasn't moving on from the magic. They kept doing it or something like that. Or they were doing magic so that someone wouldn't move on. Page of Pentacles in the reverse with the tower. Whatever they paid for, I'm guessing it wasn't enough. If they paid a dark witch, it wasn't enough. Knight of Swords, they're mad, they're angry. Ace of Cups, it did nothing but improve your self-love or make something here potent for you. Something here did not work. I saw 1551 on the clock. So it's like a, 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 a drastic change out here. We have the lovers out here. You can't mess with someone's free will. You can't mess with someone's free will. Ace of Cups out here again. Someone try to mess with someone's free will. That's what the magic was about. You are being attacked. But if you speak out, or you're going to be attacked. Um, but if you speak out against this person, you're going to look crazy. I'm going to just say that right now. Yeah, seven of swords in the reverse. They got caught. Don't worry. They were caught. Ooh, the devil in the reverse. Wow. It was definitely dark magic here being done. They stole something. Six of swords in the reverse. Queen of swords in the in upright. The death card and the four of pentacles. Tell me about the seven of swords in the reverse. It's a good idea to pretend like you didn't just see what just happened. Yeah, the Eight of Pentacles. It's like you're someone here wanted to like plagiarize, plagiarize your work or take your work or something like that. Nine of Pentacles. You guys are, are really stable. All right. You guys, it, it happened around you, but it barely even touched you. These people are going down, 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 down. They can't even move forward in their life. They're stuck to whatever they did to you. There could also be a death in the family, either in their family or... If it's happened in your family, it's because someone here did it to them. You know something about a death in the family, guys. And if you say something about it, you're going to look crazy. If so, if you really say, oh, well, they paid for black magic, you're going to look crazy, guys. I'm going to just let you know that right now. That's why it's saying it's time for healing, not war. Clarify the three of wands in the reverse. Even if you try to expose them, they would be like, what are you, what are you talking about? We have the empress out here. Five of Cups in the reverse with the Seven of Cups in the reverse. They're waiting for the Empress to be in some sort of illusion or waiting for an Empress to like be sad or in regret. She's not because she knows exactly what's going on. She could be a little bit vulnerable right now, but it's like she's trying to like fight spiritual war. This Empress is trying to fight spiritual war. She don't know where it's coming from, but she knows someone close to her. That's why she would look crazy. Clarify the Empress. Yeah, the Five of Swords in the reverse. They failed. They failed. Four wands in reverse. Now they're experiencing like some insta instability. Five of swords in the reverse. Someone did magic on your guys' stability. Then we have the six of swords in the reverse out here. Page of cups in the reverse. They're gonna come back, try to apologize to you. You're not gonna be. You're not gonna want to hear it. You don't like this person. You feel really threatened by their energy. You feel really mad. You feel. You just feel. You don't feel safe around them at all, but they're going to come back. They can't even move forward in their life peacefully. They have no peace of mind. They can't move away from this. Clarify temperance in the reverse. Someone here has a lack of healing. Clarify temperance in the reverse. Holy Spirit and Eagles. You just don't feel safe around this person. Yeah, the Page of Cups in the reverse. They're going to come around you with the fake energy. The death card out here. Their intentions were death onto you. But they're also coming around to you because something here is ending. It's not working. It stopped. I don't know what their intentions are. Are they going to ask for help or if they're just going to like pretend to be your friend? Clarify the page of cups in reverse, please, for the collective right now. Yeah, there's that fake malicious energy out here. And they're like really jealous. Ten of Pentacles of whatever that you have here. Your abundance, your ancestor lineage. Um, Ten of Pentacles could mean like your stability, like... Your commitment that you have with your children, with the Six of Cups out here too. You avoided something too. You avoided something and you're really strong. It's like, ugh. 
someone here really tried to set a trap for you. And if you expose them, you're going to be seen as crazy. Five of Pentacles is in reverse. They want to come back into your energy, hoping that it will get you, get them out of, they're doing it because you would give them karma. They're doing it because they see you as karma. You could be a Libra. They feel like if they make things right with you, it'll be okay. We have judgment out here with the High Priestess and the King of Cups. Yeah, it's like someone here just knows deep down that if they get on your good side, it'll make things better or they will get out of the cold or they don't have a connection to their ancestors. So they want to get in connection with your ancestors or something like that. I can't believe the death in the family is right underneath I'm a dark witch or I know when. They really killed someone in your guys' family or their family. And they're going to act like they didn't do it. Travel for work. They traveled to do this. They did something out here. They traveled for work and came back like they didn't do something. Clarify the uh, high, the uh, hierophant in the reverse. And you can't stand this person's energy. You don't want this person around you. But you're being called to heal and not cause war. We have the uh, Ace of Cups out here in the reverse with the moon. They were doing deceptive things behind the scenes to you. Even though this person came towards you with like, this person could be like a fake spiritualist. They could have came to you in love and light, but they really meant to hurt you. Three of swords out here. Justice out They're going to be, it's going to keep balancing out to where you're better than them at all times. Yeah, judgment is always here with justice. The high priestess is out here. You're following your discernment. You know exactly what's going on. I feel like you're also getting downloads about what this person is doing. The Octorian Light Code, that card I pulled out in the, in the beginning, it, they're giving you, they're letting you know what's going on. We have this King of Pentacles in the reverse out here. Queen of Cups in the reverse, the Nine of Cups out here. King of Pentacles in the reverse, why is this here? For the Collective. You don't trust this person because you know exactly what they did spiritually. And you know no one will believe you either. But it's like, it's really hard to... It's really hard to blame this person for what they've done if like there's no... I mean, there's really no proof of, of spell work. It just looked like a death in the family. We have the sun card out here. Ace of swords. This person is being exposed as someone that's unreliable. They're not reliable. Clarify the, uh, and you know this is true. It's like you're following your discernment. You know someone here is very unreliable. They're coming back to you because they don't have any money. Clarify the eight of cups here in the reverse. For the collective, Holy Spirit, angels. Four pentacles. Trying to hold on to something so someone doesn't move forward. The world card in the reverse. They really don't want something to end out here. Three of pentacles in the reverse with the king of, king of cups out here and the knight of wands. Yeah. Clarify the uh, Four of Pentacles with the Eight of Cups in the reverse. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, they're trying to hold on to someone's money. They're trying to hold on to your money. They're trying to... It's not working, though. It's still... It's still not working. You still get something out here. Or you still have... You still get favor. You still get unlimited abundance out here. Two of Swords. They want you to not see that. Justice justice keeps coming out some of you could be going to jail over a secret that they did here oh thank you guys for your don donations by the way uh, i greatly appreciate it but anyway um clarify the uh page of pentacles in the reverse Holy Spirit and Angels. Why is the Page of Pentacles in reverse? Wow. King of Wands in reverse. Someone here has nothing to offer. They're very sleazy. They could be literally after someone for their money, but they're losing things. They don't have anything. You know this about this person. You're being really quiet and you're really being very smart. I'm really pr proud of you guys because me, I wouldn't be, you know, <laughs> Knight of Swords out here. You guys are being very quiet and very smart about this sleazy, sluggish, play too they play too much someone's energy out here is just like bad 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 energy someone here's a player out here nine of wands someone here um instead of like uh 
getting a job they just up their body count when it comes to like sex and everything like that nine of wands they're gonna keep doing it they have problems mentally with the nine of wands out here Some of you rushed into something and paid for something out here that they didn't even have enough money to do it, but they did it anyway. And now they're experiencing like financial lack or now they'll always have nothing. They didn't think before they did something or they were like an abuser or a tyrant or they were just like, yeah, let's do this. This could have been a masculine that, that did this. Now he's experiencing, could be a cancer for some of you guys. Now he's experiencing lack and... It was their fault that someone here died in the family. Like, I can't, I can't, this is right in my face. It says change, but it also says death in the family. It could be a change in the family or a death in the family that has happened to somebody out here. Please do not take that part if it does not resonate with you. I'm not trying to cause, you know, any deaths in anyone's families. I will not, never call that on someone's life, but someone called this on somebody and it backfired. And it caused a death in their family. If you guys don't have the uh, Pure Magic book with you, um, go ahead and Google the Pure Magic book Closing Circle and read what it says. The Closing Circle spell um, on upon this energy, okay? If you feel like you're still being attacked by it, all right? Clarify the uh, Knight of Swords out here, please. Nine of Swords. Some of you are stressed out. And they're mad. Queen of Wands out here. That's someone who's like really beautiful and attracting a lot of things in her life. They try to stop something for her. They try to stop someone's confidence. This person is experiencing like a lot of, uh, clarify the Nine of Swords. They're experiencing a lot of stress. They can't sleep at night. They know what they've done. Two of Wands, Five of Wands, Eight of Swords, Five of Pentacles, Five of Cups in the verse. They really try to, I don't know, this person is not as strong as you either. And they're stressed out. They want someone here to stay in some sort of like a... If you fight back with this person, you're going to be trapped. That's what's going to happen. This is what they want. Don't do it. Be in the energy of the Five of Cups in the verse. You have nothing to lose. You didn't lose anything out of all this. Yes, it, it was very threatening. It kind of makes you mad that this person even tried it, but don't. Just don't. Clarify the two of wands, please, for the collective. You're choosing a different path. Yeah, queen of wands. And she's upright. You have, you still have all your confidence. You're still beautiful. You're still untouched. You're still unscathed. Someone here teamed up with somebody. You dropped this person. Clarify the lovers, please, is the outcome for the collective. Why is the lovers here? That's the outcome. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune out here. Getting everything that you deserve. You could be attracting a lover. Or it did nothing but attract new lovers into your life when this happened here. Whoa. What's wrong, babe? Four wands in the reverse. Someone here, someone else is also experiencing instability. Four of Swords, and they're sick about it. Hold on one second. I'm almost done. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, Cam Dog, the frog, woke up from his nap. All right, so we have this Four of Wands out here and the Wheel of Fortune out here. Yeah, you guys are getting good karma for all this. You guys are getting good karma for all this. I know in your heart you want to expose what this person has done. You want to tell somebody, but you know you're going to look crazy, so just don't tell anybody, all right? It's hard to explain black magic to the police, all right? It's just, it's never going to go anywhere, right? Clarify the four of wands in the reverse for the collective. Ace of wands reverse, something here failed. I feel like all this stemmed from, like, you coming together with somebody. And you guys are still going to come together. I feel like it was, like... You know, because your money can, like, be attached to, like, who you attract. Like, I guess they thought that, you know, if you didn't have money or something like that, then you would never attract the person that you want. Or you'd be too focused on money instead of love and, like, something like that. So, some of you wanted to start off with that. 
and attracts so that you wouldn't attract somebody out here. We have discovery, inquiry, weirdness, and curiosity. Someone was curious. They wanted to see if it will work. It didn't work. So that's why curiosity killed the cat. Curiosity killed the cat. They wanted to know, hey, I wonder if this spell would work. Yeah, let's do it. And it all just fell apart. Follow your own good advice. Trust yourself. Know what's best for you. What else, please, for this reading? Holy Spirit and Angels. Yeah. Know what's best for you. What's best for you is to just don't say anything. Someone could try to, like, try to get you to go against them. Just don't. It's time for healing, not war. We have it's always tea time, eternally, eternity, endless moments, and repetition. These people are going to be caught up in some sort of cycle that they don't want to be in. Let me get one more, please, for the collective. They're going to be stuck in the cycle, the same cycle that they wanted for you. I'm also getting like your curiosity, your weirdness about this whole situation, you put two and two together. If you were a normal, everyday, modern person, you would have never put two and two together, but you know. You know this secret. And you're being told to just keep quiet. We have keeping up immense effort in advance. Yeah, someone, someone's going to have to try to keep up with you again, all over again, because they try to make you start all over. Now they're going to have to start all over with their life. Let me get one more of these. I, I didn't even get to use these yet. I didn't even get to use these yet. Let's see. Grief. Tears are what happens when the ice in the heart melts. These people are experiencing grief for what that, whatever they've done. We have receiving, courage, true offering. Yeah. You guys are going to be receiving a lot of things in your life. If you let the situation go, not everything needs to like, sometimes strength comes from letting things go. Let me be open to creatively courageously take the steps that are shown yeah let that go let the energy let the energy of always exposing things all the time it doesn't always have to be exposed all the time i know it's it's a lot of grief it's a lot of like you're experiencing a lot of grief i see it you really do want to expose whoever did this to you every day it becomes easier to receive the highest divine plan and to trust my inner guidance true offering takes what can be unbearable cross and returns it to love yeah yeah that's what i'm getting here but guys also tap into what i was talking about when it comes to this pure magic if you so that this, so that this doesn't happen again some of you are definitely traveled to do black magic behind the scenes and you know this i'm confirming it for you all right if you guys need to talk about it you're welcome to email me all right so uh, this is your guys' reading. I hope this resonated for you guys. If it did, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. See you next time. Bye.